Sandy beaches. Look again, Lindbergh. That's not sand, it's snow. All right, who's the wise guy who moved Hawaii? Hawaii, my shoulder, the ocean. Hawaii, my shoulder, the sea. Scooby, you're the navigator. Where's the map to Honolulu? Honolulu? Uh, right here. Scooby, this is a map to the Himalayas. Himalaya, Honolulu, what's the difference? About 7,000 miles. Oops. Huh, sorry I'm late, Daph. The traffic was murdered. Is uh, this everything? Uh-huh. Got the maps? Yeah. Are you sure you haven't forgotten anything? <laughs> Fred, what is with you? Yes, I'm sure, I'm sure. Well, then... Surprise! Happy birthday, Daphne! <laughs> Gosh, it's great to see you all. I've been working so hard, I guess I forgot my own birthday. I hope you don't mind, but I, I asked the gang to come along. Oh, Freddy, this is the best birthday present ever. It'll be just like old times. Be silly. There's absolutely nothing to be afraid of. Ah! My foot! Ah! It's the monster! No, even worse, there is mud on my new go-go boots. Get it off! Get it off! What do you mean I can't have seven carry-on bags? That is so economy. Crap. Oh, no. I'm not talking to you guys. What the heck are you doing here? Isn't it obvious? We all received the same letter from one Emil Mondavarius, the reclusive owner of Spooky Island. Not fair. I was going to solve a mystery all by myself for the first time ever. How are you going to save yourself when you get caught? I'm a black belt now. I've transformed my body into a dangerous weapon. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Daphne, what is it? There's icky gunk all over my new shoes. Chinkies. I bet that's a clue. Hey, Daph, how are you going to get back with only one shoe? You know me. I always come prepared. Hmm, if that's our first clue, I wonder how this is connected to the Leland legend. We should talk to an expert, and I know just the man. His men keep hearing disturbances. But whenever they investigate, nobody's there. Gang is misunderstood. We're just solving mysteries. All the kids are doing it. No, no they're, they're not. not. And what about this Fred Jones? Certainly there must be other boys. Not like Fred. He's like one of those geniuses that no one understands until they're dead. He sees things different, and he wants to catch those different things in his traps. Honey, we just want you to go on to have a rich career like your sister's. That's Fred and the gang. Gotta go. Don't want to be late for school. Bye, Mom. Bye, Dad. Bye, Daisy. Bye, Don. Bye, Dorothy. Bye, Delilah. Hey, guys. My name is Daphne Blake. How's everybody doing tonight? So, the abominable snowman, right? Personally, I feel kind of bad for the guy. I mean, we actually refer to him as abominable. <laughs> for what? He lives in the frozen mountains, minds his own business. Abominable? Really? Why so judgmental? If people yelled, oh, no, it's the abominable Daphne every time I walked into a room, I'd eat some mountain climbers, too. <laughs> Thanks, Fred. Ladies and gentlemen, he just realized what he's wearing. We do. Maybe he wants his Scooby snack. <laughs> I don't have any Scooby snacks. I always have a spare. Sorry. And that's why I always have a spare spare. <gasps> Scooby! I'm so weak. <laughs> 